Consumers Union, the uh, independent nonprofit publisher of uh, Consumer Reports. We don't just test uh, tires and toys, we try to help people with good uh, medical products. And uh, uh, we are enthusiastic users of comparative effectiveness research to help uh, consumers save money and get the uh, cheapest uh, but most effective and safest drugs. And uh, Dr. Casti, uh, we would go with that $20 generic over that purple pill because it's. Uh, they're scientifically the equivalent. <laughs> Wasn't the purple pill, okay. <laughs> well, anyway. Um, uh, and we've, for a long time, uh, advocated health care for uh, everybody, and we've written to our uh, subscribers saying uh, uh, that it has become obvious that the people of the country intend to see to it that the whole population shall benefit from the discoveries of modern medical science. The only question before the country now is how soon. Uh, that, unfortunately, is our 1939 auto issue. Uh, 70 years, uh, Chairman Andrews, you were saying 50 years. I'd, I'd argue 70 years. And if we'd only had reform, this was the old uh, Dingle's dad's bill, uh, Wagner Dingle we were endorsing. If we'd had passed that, I think some of the auto plants of northern Ohio and Michigan would uh, still be making the great models that are in this uh, issue. So. Uh, um, we think that uh, uh, not only would it be good for the industries of those states, but uh, more importantly, the Institute of Medicine has noted that uh, each year about 18,000 people die prematurely and unnecessarily because of uh, uh, not having health insurance. And when you think about it, since this magazine issue, um, about twice as many people have died from not having health insurance as were killed in World War II and all of our conflicts since. So it is so far past time to do something, and this will be one of the great Congresses of all time if you can pass a, a good bill. And we think the draft bill that you have before you is such a bill. Uh, we are pleased to um, endorse its uh, uh, principles and intent. Uh, we assume that there will be some more savings or progressive financing to make it budget neutral and sustainable. But this is a bill that would bring um, health security, peace of mind, um, affordable and uh, comprehensive care to uh, American families. And uh, there are too many good things in the bill to list in a five-minute statement, but uh, some that haven't got a lot of attention. Uh, uh, I, uh, well, uh, Mr. Scott had mentioned well baby care. Um, that's a benefit spelled out on page 25. And, and uh, Dr. Price and, and the other doctors who take on the Medicaid patients, uh, which is basically charity care now, you do uh, uh, the rates you're reimbursed. Uh, for primary care, uh, the, you'll be paid a lot more. And I think that's important. Uh, uh, major nursing home reforms for quality. Uh, uh, exposing the flood of uh, drug and device money to doctors and medical schools that we think uh, can so often distort uh, medical practice. Uh, and um, promoting primary care and the training of new doctors. Uh, the bill is filled with these kind of provisions. Our testimony uh, uh, lays out our health reform principles from our August magazine and how well the bill matches with those. And it's a, it's a great match, so we thank you. Uh, a bill this size, you'd be shocked if we didn't have uh, just a few suggestions for small improvements, uh, and we hope you'll consider them. Uh, one is help consumers drive towards quality more. Uh, we've been there, here for about four and a half hours, and that means that about 51 to 52 fellow Americans have died of hospital-acquired, healthcare-acquired infections. During the course of a day, it's an Air France plane crashing. We need to know more about where, uh, how hospitals do in fighting these infections and help consumers with that kind of public information. And the other thing is um, uh, both the Chamber and Eric spoke about uh, consumers being better shoppers. Um, we're lousy. We're lousy health insurance shoppers. We leave a lot of money on the table. We're confused by the whole process. If you give us exchanges where there's insurance definitions are identical, where we can compare hospitalization means hospitalization, not starting on the second day or some fine print like that. And if you make the plans more like Medigap policies so that people can, can shop on identical plans, then we can drive price and we can move towards quality. 
But thank you very much, and uh, uh, great good luck in this wonderful project you've started. Thank you.